wife and I, we recently had our third child. Um, forgive me if I'm a little low on this. It's um, almost one o'clock in the morning. Um, I wanted to leave this thought uh, the other day. Uh, after my son was born, I was holding him in my arms and I was trying to get him to calm down. Now, granted, he was only two days old. What stood out to me in that moment was this. He had just been brought into the world. Doesn't know anything, doesn't know anyone. Um, and in this moment, he's fussy. And he, he, he doesn't know how to articulate exactly how he feels or what he wants. Um, the only way how he can articulate that is by crying. And me being his father, my wife being his mother, us being his providers, we know exactly what to provide, what to give him, what his need is based off of his cry. Um, and it just made me think about just how much God knows what we need based off of our cry. And this moment was so powerful because he was fussy and as he was fussy, he, he was hungry and, and he was just going through the motions and he was trying to adjust to life. And it just made me think about when we get upset, when we get frustrated, when we get so bogged down with so many different things in life, you know, we, we start thinking about um, all the many issues that we have that we do it on a day to day basis, all the problems, all the tribulations, all the all that stuff. But what it really boils down to in the moment is that while we're going through all of this, God knows exactly what to give us. He knows how to provide for us. Um, and it's just so funny because he was fussy and I'm holding him the entire time while he's fussy. Me being his father, holding him, embracing him, never letting him go, letting him know that no matter what, I'm here for you. I'm going to take care of you. I'm going to provide for you. And I've done that with all of my kids. All of my kids, they know this. They know I got them. But it was just in that moment, him fussy, him crying. I mean, he's in my arms and I, I know what he needs and I know how to provide for him. It just made me think about it. When we're going through so much in life, when we're fussy, when we're frustrated, when we're upset, when we're tired, when we're tired of dealing with things over and over and over again. God knows this. He still has us in his arms. He has us in his hands. What was pretty dope about that was while he was crying, it was like I just literally felt God just show me the relationship uh, between us and him. Like we're fussy. We're we complain a lot. We complain about everything. Everything's a fight. Everything's an argument. Everything is just craziness and pandemonium. But the truth of the matter is, God still has us in the palm of His hands, and He's embracing us. He's letting us know that He got us. That He will cover us. He will protect us, no matter what, because He's our Father. And that image of itself, um, just looking at myself holding my son. Um, embracing him, giving him exactly what he needs, which is love, which is at the time he was hungry, he wanted food. Um, but knowing that I know how to provide for his need, just thinking about knowing that God knows how to provide for my need. All I have to do is just lean in and embrace him, embrace what he has for me. Um, the journey isn't easy but just embrace what he has for you. That's all I got.